family of a murdered security guard is taking action against the hotel where he worked for nearly a decade. The Campbell County family spoke exclusively with our Nine on Your Side's Michaela White today about why they're suing the downtown Hilton. She joins us now in the studio. Michaela, what is the family saying tonight? Well, Tanya, Vidal Campbell says he just wants some closure with his brother Richard's death. That's why he's suing the Hilton Netherland. Ricky, you can see he always kept him a serious face, but it looked like he was holding in a laugh. It's been six months since Vidal Campbell last saw his brother, but he remembers it like it was yesterday. We sat, we sat around, remember when Ricky said this, or remember, you know, it's funny, but, and all, you know, Sometimes you remember things you did and it brought tears to your eyes. Hilton security guard Richard Campbell, or Ricky as his friends called him, was killed by a homeless man in December on his 58th birthday. Vidal describes his brother as vivacious and always the life of the party. He lived a pretty good life, I thought. Yeah. An honest guy, went to work every day to try to make a, you know, try and make a living. That's why Richard's family says they want justice. With this whole situation of what happened, we don't have no closure up. No closure. I mean, we don't know nothing. You know, could uh, if, could somebody have helped him? You know, maybe could have still been here. Maybe could have got medical attention. I mean, for the police to find him, he had to be in that stairwell for a good long time. Joseph Tucker, the man who admitted to killing Richard, is spending life in prison. Now the Campbell family is suing the Hilton Netherland for negligence and wrongful death. According to the suit, Tucker came into the hotel through the stairwell and, quote, homeless people would regularly sleep in the stairwells. This policy of leaving doors unlocked allowed access to the hotel by not only the homeless, but anyone else. And nine on your side spoke with Hilton officials and they declined to comment. The family has not yet made a court appearance. Back to you guys.